Hi guys, this is Vampress Luna. I wanted to make a quick haul video. I know I've been pretty absent lately in the past probably two to three months. I've just been super, super busy and then my health kind of declined. I ended up going to the hospital. You know, I ended up having surgery, nothing major, but you know, I was absent from even my job for like two weeks. So, you know, I was trying to recuperate and I've been wanting to make videos, but I don't have the time or it's just, you know, so many things going on in life. But I will try to be making videos at least once a week. I do have a lot of things that I have bought in, like for Halloween. I have those in my room, so I will be trying to do those videos during the week and posting them up during the week. So today I went to the Dollar Tree. As we all know, it's Halloween soon. So hopefully, you know... Some of these things are in your Dollar Trees. I've been trying to go to the Dollar Tree for the polishes that look like skulls. And I have not had any luck at all. I keep going to most of them. The ones that are around my area have found nothing. Nothing, nothing. So, let's get started with the haul I have. And here I got three of these packs of the Severed um, Fingers. And the reason I got these is because these reminded me of the ones that Michael sold last year in Halloween. They didn't have them this year. And they do have like a little nail to them. So I'm going to see if maybe I can use these as practice fingers. I won't be doing tutorials with these, of course, because, you know, throughout the year people will be like, this girl's crazy. So I got three packs of these. Again, we all know the Dollar Tree is just a dollar. And this is what some of the fingers look like. They do have the nail bed and everything. So hopefully, you know, they will work out. So I'll give that a try and I'll let you guys know. All right, the next few items that I got were two packs of these tissue papers, you can say. Uh, pocket tissues. I just bought them just so I can have for my daughter and my son, of course. Boy and a girl. So you know how that complicates things. It's six of these in a pack, and it brings ten little sheets in each one. So for the daughter, it's not that really bad. Then I got some floss that I needed for the house. Batteries, of course. You know, I only use these for, like, the remotes in the house, and they're cheap, so I really don't care. Then I saw these Ultra Last New York Color Long Wearing Featherproof Lipstick. And this is in the color... See if my camera can zoom caramel. It's 401, and this is the color. I haven't even opened it at all. Let's see if I can get it to zoom in. Okay, so yeah, there. This is the color. And then I got and I found this Milani Color Brilliance Eye Pencil. And it's two colors in one. I don't know if it has the colors here at all no it doesn't have anything but this one looks like a purplish and this one looks like a other purplish color so hopefully these are good i haven't this is the first like manoling thing that i have found in my store so hopefully it's good and then what kind of surprised me when i went there today that day at my dollar tree was these scotch tapes and you know everything is a dollar and these are pretty expensive they cost up to four dollars in any store and I was surprised that they had these. And they had these Pucker Up. This is one that's called Pucker Up. And it has lips on it. And it's purple. This one I've had before. It's the Metallic Cupcakes. I love this one. And then they had this one. Which is Blue Scales. And it looks like this. This one's cute. And these are the only three designs from stocks that they had. I probably should have picked up more just to have them in stock. But I'll see if I can go back and... Um, you know, well, get more just to keep them there. And then I like to read, so I ended up getting this. It's a novel. It's also a movie. If you guys seen it, I've seen it. It's not that bad of a movie, but I do like to read. Sometimes the books are better than the movies itself. And this one's House at the End of the Street is supposed to be like a scary suspense movie. But if you haven't seen it, you know, it's not that bad. You can watch it. It has the chick from The Hunger Games. I don't know her name. And, you know, I got that. And then I got, the last thing I got was this. And a taste of chicken soup for the soul teacher tales. And I'm going to, for Christmas time, I will be making like a little goodie bag for my son's teacher. And I will be giving her this book for Christmas. So, guys, that's my quick little haul, you know. Hopefully I can be more into YouTube again. You know, I've been super, super busy. Now with my son starting school again. 
and my daughter it's a full-time thing so hopefully i can be more around i probably won't be doing as much nail things mostly just haul things but we'll see i need more practice in that because i haven't done my nails in a while but guys thank you so much for watching and hopefully i can get back in the swing of things all right bye guys